All righty, Tony, our Pinpoint Weather Team coverage continues. It's just flurries right now, but it's going to change later tonight. Travel conditions will get slippery. Eyewitness News reporter Sean Daly joins us now live along Route 195 in East Providence. Sean. Yes, Susan and Mike, we're here on the 195 on-ramp in East Providence. This is the Taunton Avenue on-ramp. That's the Washington Bridge down there beyond the Iway Bridge. That sets the scene. You can see here traffic is flowing freely. In part, no doubt, because of the holiday, the Martin Luther King holiday reduces the number of cars on the road, obviously. We talked to a couple of people about this snowstorm. Here's what's on their minds. What are your thoughts about the snow? What I thought about the snow? I don't like it at all, but I got to take it. <laughs> you, you can't know? stop it? No. I wish I could. <laughs> this may be the best advice of all in this snow. I gotta pump some gas, man. I gotta take a ride out to Connecticut tonight through all this. So, so you're gonna be out on the road in all this? Yes, I am. How's that gonna work out? Hopefully, very well. All right. Thank you, guys. And judging from what we're seeing so far, it probably will work out for him. But later, it could get, as Tony was saying there earlier, a little dicier. Although here we are, we hardy New Englanders, no doubt, can persevere. Live with the Mobile Newsroom, Sean Daly, Eyewitness News. Stay with Eyewitness News for continuing coverage of this live Pinpoint Doppler 12 weather alert. Tony will be back in his, with his full future cast in less than 15 minutes. Plus, our coverage continues tonight on Eyewitness News at 10 and 11. Then we will be back on the air live starting at 4.30 a.m. on Eyewitness News this morning. You can also find the latest weather information on WPRI.com. There we will have school closings, parking bans, and weather alerts. And a reminder that there will be no morning pre-K in Providence. And if you're using your cell phone to access that information, be sure to click on the red triangle at the top of your screen.